looks really nice. breaking my rod. It's <laughs> fighting good. Keeping me out there. Oh, he's the kid. Uh, I was the rod's up at the bridge here. You tell me when he's close, okay? Can you reach him yet? <laughs> Good nice. job, Louie. Yeah. yeah, that's a nice sheep. See if you can hold them up. Yeah, you know right off the bat if they're heavier, right? Yes. Yeah, he was giving me a tussle because I couldn't get the rod. This rod is about uh, eight feet long. And you said earlier about fishing with a fly rod. The only problem with the long rod is, right? Yeah. The bridge about me. Yeah, see if you can hold them up. Maybe put your hand underneath so you can see them horizontally. You get to see your smiling face. Great. Perfect. Good job. They're yeah. actually a pretty fish here today. You get to you get to try one tonight. If you feel like it. Nice. Beautiful. Here in Southwest Florida in uh, January. It's an inshore fishery for the sheep's head. And we're here during the week, so there's a few people fishing. I don't know if you can see behind me, there's a long railway bridge with some people up top over there. Um, so we're fishing a section of this railway bridge where they can't really have access because there's no walkway. And one of the reasons why it's good here is because we're right at the end of one of the sections of railway. So if the water's a little bit shallower, I'll engage the power poles that we have in the back. Right now, the current is actually pushing us into the railway bridge, which is keeping us here, which is good. If you look at the front, strategically, the reason we're fishing here, these piles are a little bit deeper. We're in about seven, eight feet here because of the channel that's up there. And the more you work your way in away from the channel, the shallower it gets. You can see all the people up there. I'll try to zoom in on them. I haven't seen any action up there. I always like fishing closer to the deeper channels, the boating channels, because I feel that the fish come in off of that 10, 11 foot of water. It's like a through fair, and they come in and work the piles all the way down. So we're getting some rain right now. I took the bimini top off. 
because they didn't call for rain. Can you believe it? The weatherman was off. So we're going to keep fishing and keep using our slip bobbers. Pretty bold barb working just on the edge of that pile. That current just wants to suck it in. Is that where you got it? Right there? No, I heard about that I like your technique that you're holding, you're using the float as an indicator where it is off the piles. Because you're just waiting for one to come up and grab it. Takes a lot of patience, eh? Fishing has been slow today and I think it's because of the conditions. Tide's moving in pretty quick.